Hi Aries, welcome to my channel Aries. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Aries sign. Thank you so much Aries for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Aries for being here. This is a love reading. This is a love message for the Aries sign, please. Let us see what is coming towards you. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know. This is a for the Aries sign. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Let's see what's coming towards you. Who has the most romantic energy towards you? Who's thinking about you? What is their intention? And what is their next action? Okay, if I will be able to pick up a new love interest, ooh, I will let you know. Someone is ready to talk, Aries. They're ready to talk. Someone is ready to talk. Okay, all right, I'm just checking the camera. What can I get for the Aries sign? What can I get for the Aries sign? The Queen of Wands. This is not an X. I'm getting a multiple reading in here. You have the Queen of Wands. You have the Ace of Wands in here. You have the Eight of Wands. This Queen of Wands is ready to talk. I think there is some sort of, I'm hearing the word, twisted okay um i think you misinterpret or they misinterpret the situation or the status or something maybe you had a fight with this person or argument with this person um but regardless of that they're the queen of wands all they can think of all they can think of your situation is to end the no contact okay so there's someone out there who well partly they realize Aries that it's their fault and somehow they sense that there is an immaturity between the two of you there's immaturity there's impulsiveness this person is reflecting you know the, the Queen of Wands is looking at the Ace of Wands in here but in spite of the immaturity in spite of the miscommunication they believe that if they stay and you stay and you guys talk and you guys build the connection it could work out so the first thing that they will do is to end a no contact Aries yeah so this person is viewing you right now in social media okay or in the last in the last 48 hours this person has been viewing you has been thinking about you uh, they've been viewing you in your social media I'm also picking up Aries that this person you went for lunch or brunch okay something like there's a lunch or a brunch or food involved you had coffee with this person or there's a specific like there is a specific time in a day that you talk or you connect or you contact each other okay the four of cups um, the six of swords um, they're quite worried Okay, they're worried that you think they're moving on. For them, it's just a time out. I think, I think they're scared about some something, or I think they're scared about commitment. And also, there was some sort of miscommunication, misunderstanding. Something, something came into light with this person. Realized that they should have been a better person or a bigger person. Okay. Yeah, seven of cups. Maybe this is. I think you have probably I'm getting both of you have both of you have displayed irregularities and consistencies or maybe holding back okay I think you've displayed I think you've displayed as well I think both of you um, but regardless of that this person is decisive to end a no contact okay I'm really picking up that this person is very decisive to end a no contact and I'm hearing that this person's gonna say I'm sorry that I've confused you and I'm here and they would they would as much as much as possible this person is as soon as they're as soon as they reach out or contact you they would like to take they would like to take the conversation into personal so as soon as they this person message you today um, they want to see you right away Aries so there is a seven of cups the seven of cups in here it feels like um 
I don't want to prolong it. If if you reply, like if they text you, if you if they text you and you reply, I don't want to prolong it. I want to see you right away. They believe, <clears throat> like this person believes. This person believes that if if they see you, it will make it up for the lost time. So first they want to end the no contact, and then they want to see you. Aries, it's closely that. You know this reading it's it's more like this is connect this is a this is a situ this is a love situation that it's more of it's more of like a dating or getting to know okay it's like a it's a it's a it's a dating or getting to know not really an ex okay all right okay let's pick up more intuitive message for you romantic reading love reading for the Aries sign please okay there you go okay you have the seven of cups the Sun card and the seven of wands um, seven 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 of cups again this is the same person they want to see you like what I said okay I'm so advanced sometimes I would say the message before I pull the cards because seven of cups this is the same person seven of cups so as soon as so they will message you you would reply and they would inviting you to go out for dinner brunch or coffee like they would like to see you right away because seven of cups it will it's gonna be confusing aries if i'm gonna we're gonna do it everything in text because seven of cups they're gonna message you they're gonna they're gonna message you connect with you i see you replying as soon as you reply seven and seven and then another seven okay as soon as soon as you reply so they message you you reply to them as soon as soon as you reply this person will stop from they will stop from the messaging they will quickly shift the energy to i want to see you the sun card as soon as you respond to them or you reply to them this is it i better stop texting or calling i should immediately invite you aries okay let's see Let's see what else I could pick up for Aries sign. Might be able to pick up the same vibe, but let's see what else is coming towards you. Okay, what can I get for the Aries sign? I hope you're doing well. Who has the most romantic thoughts? Love reading. Okay. Oh, all right. Now, the next reading, this is a breakup story. This is a bad breakup story. Okay. It could be an ex. It could also be someone you dated, but the way you guys ended up things it's messy it's bad breakup it's bad romance with the five of pentacles in here the death card yeah it's the way you and this person maybe there was a ghosting maybe there was some you know altercation like verbal art like verbal altercation like verbal messages that's not nice you know maybe for some of you not all of you but there were some words said that was kind of hurtful, sharp. It, this is a bad breakup, bad romance in here, the death card, the five of pentacles in here. Oh, wow. Okay. Could be a Virgo, but this person is reflecting upon their participation. I think you guys are like a soulmate and a moth in a flame. Okay. The, the second reading, this is definitely... You have an in you have an intense personality they also have an intense personality so this is like fire by fire it's like the a song of uh sam smith i've been hearing that song lately fire by fire so this particular person is reflecting upon the bad romance the bad breakup they're definitely um they're, they're definitely remorse i'm hearing the word they're very regretful and remorseful to what they did okay someone is regretful of how they have given you the bad energy the bad romance okay um this could be a virgo you know this person aries okay this person as soon as they start thinking about you they cannot stop thinking about you so it could be this person for the last eight months, eight weeks, eight days. They don't think of you. And as soon as they think of you, they cannot stop thinking of you. As soon as they start messaging you, 
they cannot stop messaging you okay yeah six of wands yes look at that six of wands as soon as they message you they cannot stop messaging you as soon as they look into your energy lurk you stalk you they cannot unsee you and they're about to enter that energy this is going to be intense especially around the time of the full moon I think you are one of the happiest ones you've seen them call you. Um, I see this person calling you, okay? Because it's, it's quite intense. They think of you. They cannot stop thinking about you. There's something that maybe this person lurks around your photo. They've seen it. They've seen your photo, maybe an update. But once they've seen it, they cannot unsee it. And they call. Because the Ten of Cups... You're quite excited and glad that this person is calling you, not messaging you. So it's a call. It's a Ten of Cups kind of call. It's ring, ringing, ring, ring, answer the call. Strength card, oh, you don't. So for some of you, you might not answer the phone. You might. For some of you guys, I see you not answering the call. You could be in a meeting. Yes, yeah, sorry, the moon card. So you guys, they're going to call you. You could be driving in a meeting but you're gonna see the number it's gonna buzz okay so it's gonna create some one of your friend or colleague or someone you could be sitting next to somebody but someone is gonna call someone's gonna comment someone's gonna comment that hey do you want to get that because it's ringing 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 and I also see you you're, you're somewhere you cannot answer the phone you're smiling you look at the number and you smile ten of cups the six of cups yes you know the six of cups is very, this is a very sweet energy so as soon as as soon as you as soon as you receive the call as soon as you see their number you have a smile someone would even comment who's that why are you smiling the six of cups and i'm hearing the word let bygones be bygones with the six of cups in here yes after they call you so if you are not able to answer the call they're gonna send you a follow-up sweet but varying six of cups this person is going to send you a follow-up message a sweet message and also daring and the reason why i'm saying that there's something daring or flirty it's because this is a sweet message you know this is a sweet energy but there's like a um, a flower in here like the fish is looking into the flower so this person is like hey Aries I've called you you're unavailable darling can you please call me back so you maybe they're gonna call you their term of endearment towards you but there's something sweet and daring like a command of some kind a queen of pentacles oh this is you you're spiky look at that look at your crown it's a little bit spiky so they might have to wait till your next availability yeah hangman so I see you answering their message or call but they will be in the call waiting I would say it's an exciting this is an exciting cycle between the two of you because this person is coming in with regret you know I would say I mean they're coming in with a lot of I've changed, I'm wrong, I want to change, I want to try, and I want to try it with you. There's a change coming from them, okay? You would know it, you would feel it. The way they talk, the way they message you, the way they pay attention with you, the way they respond to you, it's so real time. You won't be disappointed, Aries. Thank you so much, guys, for supporting the channel. Thank you so much, guys, for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Aries, you know what to do. Please click the bell and click the subscribe button. I'll see you soon. You have a great day, Aries. Bye-bye.